I hope you can hear me. Pretty noisy down on the main road. But I've had an issue with this camera. This relatively cheap vlogging camera. Ooh, look. Come up, Mr. Bumblebee. There you are. No shortage of bees around here, thankfully. Um, <clears throat> so this is the little flowery area. That's all been sorted out and cleaned up. The apple trees are doing really well. Um, let me zoom in on that. That little bit between the two beds is scruffy. I haven't got around to fixing that yet. And if I can zoom in and get the sun, I don't think I can actually. It's, uh, the sun is so lovely and bright for, I don't know what time it is, the clock that used to be on the wall over here has subsequently broken. So, let's go. Ooh, ow, 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 my old legs hurt. So here's the um, pine bush. Lovely. This bed I still have to trample down, add some more soil, and then put the plastic membrane over it. But here, the gooseberry bush, as you can see, is really doing well. I think, well, this particular one isn't, but here we are, look. Lots and lots of little gooseberries. They're probably about about half the size they should be and being invaded by either red or black berries and even more berries down in there haven't done anything with the polytunnel because I've had no real enthusiasm to do anything with it at the moment but that's a different matter entirely um, the rhubarb let me try and zoom in a bit it's sort of quite wimpy actually and of course the other bunch of rhubarb I had Behind this fence here, the people that put in the new slab of concrete for the new oil tank totally destroyed it. So, what can I say? Apple trees are looking good. The road is extremely noisy tonight. I don't know why, maybe the wind direction or something is causing it to blow over here. Anyhow, that's it for night. That's it for now. <laughs> and it appears my battery is still full green. So maybe the previous charge of it didn't work very well. Well, I guess we'll see. Because I cannot find these batteries online. I found one source of them said unavailable um, delivery day unknown. See lovey. Bye. Okay, it's a little while later. The sun is setting, sort of. The battery indicator still says full green. And this is quite a rare occurrence. Pretty much a blue sky. If I ignore these few, what are they, cumulus maybe? I'm not sure. But it's um, getting chilly. I guess it's probably about 14 degrees C, maybe less actually. I think it's probably more like 9 or 10 degrees C. But 
but I thought I'd check out the camera again and see how the battery was holding up. Not much to say about this lot. In fact, it's been a really, really, really crap day. Oh, the battery just went red. So I guess the battery isn't really holding up very well. Oh, crap. That means I'm going to try and find another one. Oh, well. Bye.